Hi guys, how you doing? This is Rich from Rich TV Live. And today I want to speak to you about Trip Therapeutics, T-R-Y-P in Canada on the Canadian Securities Exchange, T-R-Y-P-F on the OTCQB Fully Reporting Exchange in America. Trip Therapeutics is a pharmaceutical company focused on identifying and developing clinical stage compounds for orphan disease and other diseases with high unmet medical needs. Their website is triptherapeutics.com. This is their Twitter page. Let me show you their Twitter page. It looks like this. I'm following them on Twitter. And this is their LinkedIn page. I am also following them on LinkedIn, where you can find out more about the company. This is their stock price in America. You could see they were as high as a dollar, came down. And like most psychedelic stocks, they trended down when psychedelics were down. And now that mind medicine has been really ripping, now that they're going to the NASDAQ, they're starting to make the big move back up. So you can see that they've hit a bottom and they're starting to trend up. TRYPF in America and TRIP TRYP in Canada. You can see it was up 10% today in Canada. Started off at 50 cents, made this move up to $1.20. That was the high, high and drifted down like all psychedelic stocks. And now it looks like they have found a floor and they are starting to trend back up. You can see that they were up today 10%. So very strong day for them today. And you can see here that the volume was higher than the average volume for the last three months. Average volume in Canada has been about 320,000 shares a day for the last three months traded 547,000 shares today. So starting to go in the right direction. Now let's take a look at some of this information here. This is the investor deck. Trip Therapeutics is a pharmaceutical company focused on identifying and developing clinical stage compounds for diseases with high unmet medical needs through accelerated regulatory pathways derived from the world tryptamine the word tryptamine, psilocybin, is a tryptamine compound. This is their executive summary. TRIP currently has two active development programs, psilocybin for neuropsychiatric disorders, which call on PFN program. Our lead PFN program candidate is TRIP8802. Our initial indication for TRIP8802 is fibromyalgia. TRIP-1001 for soft tissue sarcomas. And you can read about the specifics on that. You can see their development strategy, development, protect, and monetize. They've got a world-class management with experience in capital markets, big pharma, drug approvals with FDA, which is huge, especially in psychedelics right now, and profitable medical companies. So very good world-class team. Management team is led by the chief exec executive officer, James Koo, and the president and chief scientific officer, Dr. James Gilligan. World-class management team and board with significant large pharma and emerging pharma experience. You can see their management team continues with their chief operating officer, Tom Dorazio, and chief financial officer, Therese Gieselman, with the vice president of manufacturing, Larry Norder, and the board of directors, Greg McKee, founder and executive director, William Garner, and director, Gage Joel. The directors continue, Peter Molly and director James Koo. So they've got drug development programs that they are working on as we speak. So you can see the innovative drug pipeline. Trip strategy is to partner monetize programs with phase two clinical data. You can see the indication with fibromyalgia, eating disorders, other neuropsychiatric disorders, 
and you can see the Resoxan Trip 1001 soft tissue sarcomas. You can see where they are in the evaluation pre IND and phase one and phase two. TRIPS PFN trademark program is focused on developing orally delivered drug therapies for certain neuropsychiatric disorders that have distinct advantages over other drugs that are currently in the market or are in development. These advantages include increased efficiency, increased efficacy, natural blood brain barrier penetration, enhanced safety and toxicity profiles, reduced risk of abuse, reduced risk of addiction. The initial lead candidate in our PFN program is TRIP 8802, an orally delivered formulation based on the development of TRIP's synthetic psilocybin fibromyalgia is the lead indication in our PFN program. So you can see the TRIP 8802 fibromyalgia prevalence and unmet clinical need. So you can see the efficacy, tolerability, and dosing and abuse potential the fibromyalgia treatment market to surpass US 3.6 billion by 2026. So it's a huge market that they are looking to penetrate. TRIP believes that TRIP 8802's activity may make it effective in modulating fibromyalgia pain through action in the descending pain inhibitory pathway. So you can see the psilocybin bound to serotonin receptor. And you can see the TRIP 8802 is currently in clinical development. You can see their sponsor, enrollment population, year published and reported SAEs. TRIP 1001 soft tissue sarcoma. The American Cancer Society estimates that in 2020, there will be approximately, and I mean, this is a big focus, 13,000 new cases of STS and 5,000 STS deaths in the United States. There remains a significant unmet medical need for new STS treatments. So the TRIP-1 001 mechanism of action. TRIP 1001 is an oral formulation of the multifunctional anesthetoplastic agent Razoaxin. Razoaxin acts to normalize tumor vasculature, which in turn reduces metatastic progression, inhibits invasive growth, and enhances the effects of radiation therapy. The G2-M phase of the cell cycle is the most sensitive phase to ionizing irradiation, which may help explain Razoxan's enhancement of the effects of radiation therapy. You can see some of the graphs here showing the radiation and the response. So the trip 1001 clinical development, development path, work to confirm Razoxen's activity in soft tissue sarcomas in clinical trials, after which TRIP will endeavor to monetize TRIP 1001. The results of multiple phase two clinical studies of Roxaxen for the treatment of STS have been published. Six completed remissions, two partial remissions, and one minor remission were achieved, a major response rate, which is extremely impressive, of 89%. TRIP believes that existing clinical data regarding Razoxin may allow TRIP 1001 to be studied in a phase two trial without the need for extensive preclinical or phase one trials. You can see the combined Vindicine and Razoxin has shown activity and enhanced soft tissue sarcomas. You can see the statistics and the charts. 
And the company has intellectual properties, patents, know-how, and trade secrets. So what is the strategy for TRIP? TRIP intends to utilize regulatory exclusivity, patents, trade secrets, and proprietary know-how to protect the commercial prospects of the assets it chooses to develop. Patent applications for the use of psilocybin for the treatment of fibromyalgia and razoxen for the treatment of soft tissue sarcomas were filed in 2019 and 2020, respectively. PC backslash IB 2020 slash 058597 compositions and methods to improve the therapeutic benefits of biz dioop pepperazines PPA 63 017 comma 404 therapeutic method using psilocybin. Each of these applications includes additional indications that are either currently being or may in the future be evaluated as potential additions development programs. TRIP intends to utilize information gathered in its manufacturing, formulation development, and clinical programs to build its intellectual property estate, which will include additional patent applications. So they have the chemistry, manufacturing, and control, the CMC. So CMC strategy partner with third parties to manufacture our active pharmaceutical ingredients, APIs, and finished drug products. TRIP intends to file patent applications in the United States and other regions of the world based on proprietary formulations and new processes that result from the development and manufacturing of our drug candidates. TRIP has entered into an agreement with Albany Molecular Research Inc. for research, development, and CGMP manufacturing services for synthetic psilocybin that will form the basis of our PFN trademark program, including TRIP 8802. You can see the research, preclinical -pre development, CMC development commenced, and clinical development drug product. TRIP has commenced a CMC development strategy that will utilize the shortened clinical development path afforded by FDA's 505B2 regulatory pathway. TRIP has a very attractive valuation to relative peer group. So you can see their market capitalization is only 42 million. And meanwhile, when you compare them to companies like Compass Pathways, which I would say is one of the largest psychedelics companies on the senior exchange on the NASDAQ under the symbol CMPS with a market cap of 1.65 billion. TRIP is still very undervalued, underappreciated, underexposed. Comparing them to Mind Medicine, whose market cap has really been growing over the last few days with news that they are moving on to the NASDAQ, MMED in Canada on the NEO exchange with a 1.45 billion market cap. Cybin, CYBN on the NEO exchange, 290 million market cap. Celos Therapeutics, also on the NASDAQ. SEAL, S-E-E-L, is the symbol, and they have 124 million market cap. Revive Therapeutics, RVV, on the Canadian Securities Exchange, also with a 146 million market cap. So very undervalued when you compare them to their peers. Now, this is what I really like. The shares issued outstanding, 61,347,722 shares issued outstanding, very tight float, 9,495,750 warrants, 10,912,884 options and comp units. Fully diluted, we have 81,720,356 shares, very tight float. So that is the investor deck. Now let's just talk about some of the news that they've been putting out, lots of news recently. On March 9th, Trip Therapeutics appoints Luke Hayes as chief financial officer. On March 4th, previous to that, Trip Therapeutics announced an application to list on the OTCQB exchange, fully reporting exchange, very good exchange in America. On February 24th, Trip Therapeutics to present at the Stifle GMP Healthcare Conference. So they are definitely getting their word out there on the street. 
On February 17th, previous to that, Trip Therapeutics completes a $2 million strategic financing. So they are getting money. Let's just quickly look into that, the specifics on that. So a pharmaceutical company focused on identifying developing clinical stage compounds for disease with high unmet medical needs is pleased to announce that effective February 16, 2021, it has closed its previously announced financing and issued 3,333,333 million units at a price of 60 cents per unit for proceeds of $2 million. So that was a strategic investment. Mark Lustig, founder and former chairman of Origin House, was the lead investor in the strategic financing. Trip is pleased to have such a well-known and respected Canadian entrepreneur as an investor, having Mark at the critical growth stage is a significant endorsement of our management team and our drug development program, said Trip CEO, Jim Koo. And previous to that, Trip Therapeutics reaches a milestone on the psilocybin drug manufacturing program. So that was on February 16th. So steady stream of news, company with a tight share structure and very early stage, undervalued, underappreciated, underexposed, had a good day in the markets today. Love to know what you guys think. Remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for education and information purposes. Please do your own due diligence, do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here in Rich TV Live. Always invest in the best. The best is blessed. Let's just read really quickly a little bit about this news. AMRI is proud to support Trip Therapeutics in their mission to address diseases with highly unmet needs through the rapid development and scale of a novel process to advance psilocybin into human clinical trials, said Christopher Conway, president AMRI. We are leveraging our core expertise in process development and CGMP manufacturing to help progress TRIPS clinical pipeline. So that was really large. And Larry Norder, vice president, manufacturing states, we are pleased with the schedule and progress of our proprietary psilocybin development program with our partner, AMRI. In addition to process development for manufacturing psilocybin, AMRI is also managing compliance with regulations inherent with controlled substances. This compliance is mission critical, but often not given sufficient priority in drug development programs. Super impressed with Trip Therapeutics. Love to know what you guys think. Like I said, remember Risk TV Live is strictly for education and information purposes. Please do your own due diligence, do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here in Rich TV Live. Consult a financial advisor. Always invest in the best. The best is blessed. I think this has a chance to be a really great company. Now, psychedelics had a tough ride. They're now starting to trend back up. This might be the time to start thinking about taking a position and trip. I'd love to know what you guys think. Do you like this stock? Are you interested in this company? If so, comment down below, share the video everywhere, and subscribe for future updates. I will do my best to keep you guys updated on this early stage company as they evolve. Thank you guys for watching. If you're not winning, you're not watching. We bring you winners, and we love to bring them to you first. What do you guys think? of Trip Therapeutics. I think it's got incredible upside. Love to know what you guys think. This is Rich from Rich to be Live, bringing you Trip Therapeutics. Here's the website once again, triptherapeutics.com. I'm going to continue to do my research and do my due diligence. I would love for you guys to do it as well. Once again, a world-class management team, capital markets experience, big pharma experience, drug approvals, and profitable medical companies cohesive, commercially oriented management team and board with significant overlapping large pharma and emerging pharma experience. What do you guys think? I like what I see. Love to hear what you guys have to say. This is Rich from Rich to be Live saying, we'll see you soon. Have a nice day.